Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional. And today I'm super excited because we get to review Scuba Pro's top of the range ladies Everflex wetsuit. These wetsuits come in two different thickness variations. You get the 5.4 and the 7.5. The main difference being between the two, just the thickness of the neoprene itself. So the 7.5's got 7 mils over the chest and 5 mils over the arms and legs and the extremities. And the 5.4 having 5 mils over the torso area and then the 4 mils over the legs and extremities making it a lot easier to get in and out of. That's the only main difference between the suits. That's why you find product reviews for this particular suit on both products listed up on the websites. But this is a really, really great suit. There's a lot going on with it. There's a lot of little nuances and fine little touches that Scuba Pro have put on this suit that make it really, really worthwhile. If you're comparing price-wise of this suit to any other suits on the market, you'd be dead right to notice that this suit is a lot more expensive. But there's a reason for that, and we're going to go through all the little things and bits and bells and whistles that this suit has got. Then you'll find that there's a whole bunch of things on here that it's got that you didn't realize you needed until you've got them on the suit, and then you can never dive without them again. So we're going to start at the top and work our way down. First thing as far as the Scuba Pro suit's concerned is there's a lot of nice little accents on the suit itself. So they've got this embossed rubber Scuba Pro logo at the side over there. It's got some really great 3D printed type shoulder pads. And over the tops of the shoulders, you go from the standard neoprene to a matted material type neoprene over the shoulders and on the bum and the knees as well. But it's all for the areas that carry the most amount of wear. So over the shoulders where your, where your BCD is moving around, they've added this 3D type paint as well as the different material just to allow for the abrasion over the knees itself they've also done the same thing with this embossed type paint with the um, with the different material to protect the knees as well as on the bum section bum and back section over there it's a, this different type of material that really puts up with the wear and tear from sitting on boats and from putting BCDs on and off as well. There's a really great little neck zip over there. So this goes a long way to stop that gag reflex, which you've got when you're sitting on boats. If you find that you're just not feeling comfortable, you can zip it down. And when you're in the water, you can zip it up and that keeps you nice and warm. Some of the little nuances they put there, even the zip itself, a high quality YKK zip. But if you see over there, they've got this little finger tag, which is even embossed with the Scuba Pro logo on it. For you to zip up and zip down, so it makes it much easier in the water to find as opposed to trying to find that little zip up and down just stick your finger in there to zip it up and down and that makes it a lot more easy. This being the ladies wetsuit, meaning that it's got bumps in all the right places for ladies. So over the bust and bum area, it's got a lot more neoprene just to make it a lot more comfy for the ladies. And that changes as you go up and down via the size variations. There's a number of panels as you go through the front of the, the suit itself, making it quite comfortable. And everything around the whole suit is double stitched. There's a little hood holder on the right hand leg over here. So they've got an embossed Scuba Pro logo with a little clip. And that clip is to clip on your hoodie if you so choose down the arm you've got some really awesome scuba pro branding and then the ladies everflex suits on the 7.5 and 5.4 has got this white stretch of neoprene indicating that it is the ladies one on the arms and legs they have quite a big zip over here just to open it up to make it much easier for you to get your hands and your wrists and your feet and ankles through the the suit itself and it's got a semi dry seal section over here so this makes it very easy to slide through and once you've got the suit on you can see this is a different open cell type neoprene you can then fold that back in on itself just to almost create a semi dry type effect and then zip the suit over and that makes it a lot warmer and they've done that on the ankles of both of these as well making it much easier to get in and out of and on the right hand wrist over here they've got the same thing as well you can zip that open and down again so it covers all the parts of the of the suit if we flip over at the back just to see what's going on we can see that it's got scuba pros patented angular zip over there so instead of the zip going straight up like a lot of the suits have their one goes over the left to right making it a lot more ergonomic for you to pull that zip up and they've also reinforced the 
base of the zip with this embossed scuba pro pad and it's got a little finger loop over there for you to reach around and just grab your finger as you try to zip it up yourself. However, top tip from me whenever working with these suits, it's always a good idea to try and get your buddy to help you. So when you're about to zip up the suit, call your buddy over and just arch your back and get them to zip it up for you. That goes a long way as far as ensuring the longevity of the zip's concerned. You don't want it to pull out because you're rushing to get down to a boat, but I really like that angular design. They've also folded over and double sealed the zip section and blind stitched it. So that means that this suit is a lot stronger in that area. And if we open up at the top, the other thing I like is this little Velcro pad, which goes over the top. So if you zip the suit up, you just attach a bit of Velcro and stops the zip from coming down on a dive. And they've also got this extra stretch of open cell neoprene here, which goes underneath the zip. So it almost seals over itself to reduce water movement through the suit itself, which will keep you nice and warm on the dive. And it's got this Velcro neck seal, which will just fold around your neck as well, just to keep you nice and warm. When you look inside the suit itself, you see it's got this really funky plush lining. And it's almost like a seal skin type fur. So that traps the water against your body and really goes a long way to warm you up. And that's over the main torso section. So that's also a really, really good thing as far as this suit is, is concerned, because it's really, really warm. Even though it goes from the thicker to the thinner neoprene on the outskirts and extremities, it really does keep you warm because of that. There's a lot of panels down the back leg section over here and you've got this really awesome embossed Scuba Pro logo on the back right hand calf and at the tops of the ankle seals they've got an embossed Scuba Pro logo or pad just to strengthen the top of the zip as well around their ankles too and you've got your zip tag over here just to help pull it up and down. So there's your overview of the Scuba Pro Everflex wetsuits available in the 7.5mm and the 5.4 variations on our site. A really, really high quality suit. You can see it in all the little nuances that Scuba Pro have thought of as far as the suit is concerned. And it is also super, super stretchy, making it really easy to get in and out of when you're diving as opposed to those B-grade neoprene suits. So it's super comfy, super warm. I understand, yes, an expensive suit, but you get what you pay for because Scuba Pro are renowned for making some of the best quality scuba gear on the planet today. So there's that review of the Scuba Pro Everflex. And if you guys are enjoying these product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel or go check out our social streams. The main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.ca.za. We've also got all the other ones. Just give scuba.ca.za a search and we're sure to come up and we'll keep you up to date with all the funky things that we've got going on, as well as the promos and specials that hit our website on an ongoing basis. So that's it from you guys. And I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.